When I hear comfort food, the first thing that comes to mind is macaroni and cheese. But why not change it up a little bit and throw some rotisserie chicken in there? The first thing we're gonna do is knock out a little bit of prep. Go ahead and dice up a shallot, some garlic. We're gonna shred some Santori Montamori cheese. And next, we're gonna simply carve up the chicken. We're gonna start cooking. The prep is really, really quick for this dish. So we're gonna go ahead and start cooking. In a large hot saute pan with a little bit of olive oil, we are gonna caramelize the garlic and shallots. Once they are brown, we're next gonna add in some heavy cream, turn the heat down to medium low. What we wanna do now is thicken it up really nice. While that is thickening, in a large pot of boiling salted water, we're gonna go ahead and cook our elbow macaroni. We're only gonna par cook it, because remember in the oven, it is also going to cook. When the macaroni is done cooking, the cream should be finished and nice and thick also. Go ahead and whisk in the cheese that we grated, get it nice and thick, and now we simply want to assemble. In a large bowl, we're gonna to mix together the macaroni, the cheesy cream, the rotisserie chicken. We're gonna to toss that around, put it in a souffle dish. We're gonna to top off with some breadcrumbs, drizzle on a little olive oil. It's going in the oven on 375 degrees. Gonna take in between 25 and 30 minutes. This is such a great way to utilize a rotisserie chicken or any other leftover chicken you may have. And notice I did not use any salt or pepper because you'll get a ton of flavor from that cheese. I've got mac and cheese. Does life get any better? We'll see you next time.